We're going to talk about Fog of War. I have loaded up a map that has Fog of War enabled by default. But if I go into the Fog of War tool, which is this button here, it opens up the toolbox. Uh, and I have a polygon tool, a box tool, um, I have visible, invisible, and then the arrow. And the way to think about this is you can draw with these two tools and you can either paint with visible area or invisible area or, or hidden area. Uh, so if I wanted to, for instance, show this room, I could paint with a visible area. So I can click and drag out this polygon. Which now shows a visible area and I can always change this to an invisible area. So I can set up this map ready with my areas of fog of war and just come in here and turn fog of war areas on and off. The interesting way um, that fog of war works inside of tabletop though, is that what we've actually done is we've carved this portion out of this larger portion. And so they are, they're independent of each other. So if I turn the fog of war on for this area, notice that it doesn't affect this other area. So this area now is independent of the greater fog of war. And I can continue doing that. For instance, I could create an area inside of this room, which is hidden. And notice that this area is independent of the outside area. So if I turn this fog of war on, I can still turn this off. So I can create a visible area inside of a, a, a hidden area. And you can continue doing that and it, it basically it creates some uh, interesting uh, ways that you can create uh, fog of war areas this way. Um, notice there is a Z order, so even though you can't uh, change the order of things, this takes precedence over what's underneath it. So, uh, like I said, this creates some very interesting ways to be able to use fog of war. And it's really powerful if you want to leverage it, but it's also very simple to and straightforward to use. Um, kind of in a, a very simple way, you can just draw out the areas you want to hide. And at any point you can come in and either show them or hide them.